This is the story of Princess Guinevere and the Jewel Riders. Let's begin now. All of Avalon is busy preparing for tomorrow's Circle of Friendship ceremony. It's the biggest day of the year for Princess Guinevere. At the ceremony, she will receive the magical sunstone and be paired with a special animal friend. At last, she will be a jewel rider like her friends, Fallon and Tamara. The jewel riders have a very important responsibility in Avalon. The great wizard Merlin tells Guinevere and her friends, the goodness of the wild magic created by the crown jewels flows through every part of life in Avalon. It is your destiny as jewel riders to maintain the balance of magic in the kingdom. You must work with your chosen animal friends to protect the crown jewels. Guinevere's evil aunt, Lady Kale, is jealous of Merlin. She wants the power of the crown jewels for herself. With the help of her Dweezil sidekicks and Grim the Dragon, she discovers a powerful new jewel, the Dark Stone. <clears throat> With the power of the Dark Stone, I will be able to ride the wild magic and reach all of the magical spots in the kingdom, shouts Lady Kale. I will capture the crown jewels and Avalon will be mine! We're with you, witchy one! cried the Dweezels. <coughs> Lady Kale finds Merlin and traps him in a magic bubble. <coughs> Give me the key to the crown jewels, or you will be lost in the wild magic forever! says Lady Kale. Just as Merlin is about to give her the key, a helpful hawk swoops in and carries it away. After that bird, shouts Lady Kale. She banishes Merlin to the wild magic with the dark stone. Grim the dragon hurts the hawk's wings with his fiery breath. The wounded hawk lands in the grove where a young winged unicorn, Sunstar, is grazing. Please take this key to the crystal palace, the hawk sputters. But Lady Kale has already seen Sunstar. Great beasts! A flying unicorn! cries Lady Kale. Give me that key! Sunstar is too young and clumsy to fly. She can't escape the Dweezels. <laughs> At the Crystal Palace, Queen Anya and King Jared have learned of a disturbance in the wild magic. They are worried about Merlin. Someone is using a powerful new jewel that was not tuned by Merlin. It is upsetting the balance of the wild magic and the kingdom is in danger. You must find Merlin, says King Jared. Guinevere, the pack, and the jewel riders set out for Merlin's cottage. The jewel riders arrive at Merlin's cottage too late. It has been ransacked by Lady Kale's dweezels. Merlin's owl friend, Archie, is there to tell the jewel riders where to go. Go! Lady Kale has stolen the crown jewels! Ride the wild magic to Ravenwood! She must be holding Merlin prisoner there! cries Archie. Hurry! Guinevere and the jewel riders ride the wild magic to Ravenwood. There, they find Lady Kale, who has caught Sunstar and stolen Merlin's key to the jewel box. Princess Guinevere tries to rescue Sunstar from the Dweezel's jail. Fallon and Tamara use their jewels against Lady Kale and the Darkstone. Spike, Tamara's brave baby panther, tries to save Tamara. Look out, Spike! cries Tamara. Spike is struck by the beam of the dark stone. Tamara rushes to his side. She cries to Fallon in the pack. Power up! We must form an enchanted jewel circle to heal Spike. By the power of the heart stone, says Tamara. By the power of the moonstone, says Fallon. By the power of the forest stone, says Drake. With the power and goodness of the enchanted jewel circle, Spike is quickly healed, but Lady Kale escapes into the wild magic. Guinevere, 
the Jewel Riders, and the pack chase Lady Kale to Thornwood. It is the dark land she has created for her castle. Lady Kale has captured Merlin's key from Sunstar and opened the jewel box. The jewels will give me the power to control the wild magic. Now I will rule all of Avalon! <laughs> Cackles Lady Kale. Mm, mighty magic witchy thing! cried the Dweezels. <laughs> Suddenly, Merlin appears in the center of the Ring of Jewels. Your dark magic couldn't destroy me, Kale, Merlin says. Until safety is restored to Avalon, I return the crown jewels to the lands from whence they came. He casts the jewels into the seven corners of the kingdom. <laughs> Lady Kale is angry that Merlin ruined her plans to rule Avalon. She tries to summon her dark magic again, but she can no longer control the Dark Stone. The stone's magic turns against her and destroys Thornwood. <laughs> Lady Kale's dark castle crumbles and the ground splits open. Oh no! Where's Guinevere? cries Tamara. She and Sunstar fell into that hole, says Fallon. At that moment, Sunstar flies out of the hole. Princess Guinevere is safe on her back. I knew you could fly, Sunstar, says Guinevere. Guinevere, the Jewel Riders, and the pack return to the Crystal Palace for the Circle of Friendship ceremony. Princess Guinevere receives the Sunstone and is united with her special animal partner, Sunstar. Finally, Guinevere is one of the Jewel Riders. Merlin congratulates her and calls the Jewel Riders to action. We must restore the balance of the wild magic. Go in search of the crown jewels and return them to safety. Then Avalon will be peaceful again, says Merlin. Guinevere and the Jewel Riders power up to prepare for their next great adventure. Stone, you're tuned into the Jewel Riders Archive.